Hey guys, so NBA Ball here's another video. So today's video is gonna be how to cheese and 2K16. And I swear to you, it is so you can get angles. You can get angles. You will break too many angles. You can be so fast they cannot see you. They cannot see you. You will drive right past them. So guys, let's get into it. You already know how I'm rocking. So let's get it, man. All right, so basically, there's a new cheese. You can't just take the ball and just cross over and cheese. That's, you can't do it no more. I mean, you can do this. Let me show you guys. You can do this, for example. But in 2K16, this is not considered cheese anymore. Not anymore. See that right there? It's not cheese anymore. You you can't even do it back to back. Well, I mean, you could do it back to back, but it's not considered cheese anymore because it slows down. Like, see, look, and I'm doing it perfectly, and it's gonna slow down. And there's a new way how to cheese. So, like I was saying before, I showed you guys. Here it is. So basically, guys, what you wanna do is go to your inside and out. You wanna get Jamal Crawford. And by the way, this is on my small guy. Thank you, Pretty Boy Fredo, for putting that out. I, I really appreciate that, man. Let's have a squad hoopers. So now we got Jamal Crawford inside and out. And inside cross, I, and iso size of cross. And as you know, those that crossover on 2K15, I think it's crossover 18 or 16, this is considered it. But that's what you're gonna need to cheese, right there. And then iso escape. You can get Kyrie Irving if you want, but that doesn't even matter. But the only thing that matters is Jamal Crawford and guard one. For ISO, guard one is for ISO size of cross. And then Jamal Crawford for inside and out. Basically, if you want to do the Jamal Crawford, for the people who don't know, make sure it's in your left hand or right, whatever one. Say so if it's in your left hand, hold R2. You, then you do is gonna put your hand up or like move a different way. And then with the right analog stick, go left and then keep going right to left you'll get the hang of it you'll get used to it so now for this move if you want to do it you have the ball in your right hand go inside with the right log stick go in like left and right this so now just go left and right with the right hold r2 left and right with the right log stick and basically what this does is hesitates your you know your defender and makes him think oh no where is he gonna go you're gonna go right left and then he's gonna start to stumble you'll get ankle breaker too many times with this but this is the new cheese i guarantee it so thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video so please subscribe and please leave a like and a comment thank you guys for watching nba bar signing out peace